video, I will calibrate the sound beam that I created in previous video for stainless steel welded sample. I can start with the main MIDI again. Before we go through, uh, we can choose 800 amplitude resolution and the next uh, interleaf is on. And with the filter, we can make it on for better visualization and choose the filter band pass filter 4 megahertz. And we can make point quantity as much as possible uh, maximum, okay? And then we have we can we have here it's two notches uh, on on bottom side you can see in the in the right side of the well now I'm on top of it and I have another top notch I will try to use this two notch for the two angle calibration make it this two amplitude 80 and 80 here as you can see that with 30 uh, 20 uh, degree angle we have 80 amplitude from the bottom notch and you can see here it's back wall and when I move to the top notch here with the 89 degree you can see that it's I have 13 14 amplitude coming from the top notch which is not good and enough so what we can do here we can keep this position for the bottom notch and we can click blend and calibrate and PE calibration and we can go through sensitivity. After that, we can choose two angle calibration. And one of these angle, angle will be targeting the bottom and other one will be target on the top. And then we can choose angles. And <clears throat> the first angle that's 20 and the second angle will be 89. So then I'm on 20 degree and uh, locating on the bottom notch and I can click next and I can click calibrate 20. After that I can move to the bottom notch and I can click next angle. Now the uh, it's detected by the machine with a small amplitude and I can click calibrate 89. After that you can see on the calibration screen now my top notch is 80 and my bottom notch is 80. Then I can click exit calibration from right top menu and done. Now you can check here it's with the bottom notch we have 80 and 80 and on the top notch click and move to the cursor here and we have 80 amplitude coming from the top notch. So that's basically how you can calibrate sound beam with the DMA props using two angle sensitivity calibration. Thank you.